Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. We are going to start our uh, new topic, which is actually a uh, uh, last two steps of replications. Uh, so we had studied about a uh, uh, few steps of replication or many steps about replication. Then the uh, it's a la last few steps of replications are very important because uh, uh, because uh, release or assembly and release of viruses actually depends upon or uh, different types of viruses in mean uh, enveloped or non enveloped viruses uh, adopt different ways uh, to uh, uh, to get release into external environment so uh, it, uh, assembly and release are also la uh, also important uh, parts of uh, viral replication cycle from your just point of view a whole cycle is uh, whole replication cycle is important uh, uh, you are uh, you have you sh you would question about uh, 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 you should uh, uh, question uh, you can uh, uh, people uh, UHS can ask about uh, uh, drawing of replication cycle so uh, be prepared for anything we will cover three important things in this lecture. We will uh, discuss about the assembly of viruses or complete formation or complete shape formation of virus in this cycle. And then after completion of virus, uh, we will discuss the release of virus from one host cell to another host cell. Uh, obviously, uh, there are uh, hundreds of copies prepared from one cycle. Then we will discuss the release of hundreds of copies from a single cell. So uh, we will discuss enveloped and non enveloped viruses uh, uh, release and then we will <coughs> discuss about a special point which is uh, is known as lysogeny so uh, let's start our today's two days lecture first step is the assembly of viruses assembly of viruses how packaging yeah assembly of viruses occurs uh, a simple reason uh, after formation or after uh, formation or uh, manufacturing of uh, structural protein in the host cell of viruses uh, in the host cell uh, then uh, these structural proteins uh, starts binding with uh, or transported through Golgi complex or endoplasmic reticulum of the host cell and uh, and and started binding with uh, nucleic acid then after when nucleic acid or capsid for uh, become uh, 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 join in a single shape or in a form of mature virus then it is known as a nucleocapsid so nucleocapsid then uh, if a virus is non enveloped then uh, this is actually a packaging uh, packaging uh, how packaging occur in a simple way uh, uh, there are two types of uh, packaging like in uh, first case so we can say uh, proteins or structural proteins arranged around the uh, nucleic acid of viruses according to uh, decided or G, uh, a decided way actually uh, actually how uh, genes yeah how virus decides ke jo uh, hai proteins ko kis join karna it depends upon the uh, genes in the virus so you can uh, uh, you can see in a diagram uh, uh, in directional assembly around genome if a uh, it's a bacteriophage virus but there are two components in the bacteriophage virus one is and the other is tail in the head region uh, in the tail region you can observe in a first diagram helical capsid in uh, in helical capsid you can observe the formation of uh, uh, formation of capsid around the uh, nucleic acid so uh, uh, how nucleic acid how capsid arrange around the nucleic acid you can uh, observe in diagram first diagram easily so uh, according to genes according to information present on the genes of the nucleic acid of uh, viruses capsid proteins arrange around the dna or rna of the virus in second in another diagram you can observe the isocetral uh, packaging it means uh, 
स्ट्रक्चरल प्रोटीन अरेंज या फॉर्म आइसोसाइड्रल और हेड ऑफ द बैक्टीरियो फेज हाउ हेड फॉर्म दैन यू कैन सी इजीली फॉर्मेशन ऑफ हेड डेट स्ट्रक्चरल प्रोटीन अरेंज अकॉर्डिंग टू अ शेप अकॉर्डिंग टू इंफॉर्मेशन अराउंड द डी एन ए ऑफ द वायरस अराउंड द जिनोम ऑफ द वायरस सो आफ्टर कम्पलीशन ऑफ दिस आफ्टर कम्पलीशन ऑफ दिस स्ट्रक्चर दिस वायरस इज एक्चुअली मेच्योर वायरस दिस एक्चुअली अ न्यू वायरस इज ए दिस न्यू वायरस हैज़ एबिलिटी टू इन्फेक्ट अदर होस्ट सेल अदर नॉर्मल होस्ट सेल दैन इन लास्ट डायग्राम यू कैन ऑब्जर्व सम इम्पोर्टेंट थिंग्स लाइक हाउ दिस इज एक्चुअली स्केफोल्ड आइसो हैड आइसोसेट्रल कैप्सिड एनी अदर इज एक्चुअली एन अदर टाइप ऑफ वायरस इन विच डी एन ए और डी एन ए हाउ डी एन ए एंटर्स इन दी यू कैन सी हाउ डी एन ए एंटर्स इन दी कैप्सिड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल कैप्सिड फॉर्म दैन डी एन ए गेट्स एंटर्स इन टू दी कैप्सिड सो न्यूक्लो कैप्सिड फॉर्म और कंप्लीट वायरस गेट्स फॉर्म सो एक्चुअली यू शुड सी यू शुड नाउ डैट वट इज असम्बली ऑफ द वायरस असम्बली ऑफ द वायरस इज असम्बली या असम्बली और पैकेजिंग ऑफ द वायरस इज एक्चुअली एक्चुअली कंसिस्ट ऑफ कम्बिनेशन ऑफ वायरस एंड द वायरस एंड दायरस न्यूक्लिक एसिड वायरल न्यूक्लिक एसिड एंड द कैप्सिड प्रोटीन वैन कैप्सिड प्रोटीन अरेंज अराउंड अरेंज अराउंड द डी एन ए और आर एन ए ऑफ द वायरस एंड एंड न्यू कम्प्लीट वायरस फॉर्म इट इज़ नोन एज पैकेजिंग और असम्बली ऑफ द वायरस सो it also observed that in vitro or in test tube when structural protein and the rna is present in the virus but we have mixed both things separately then after few minutes we we found complete virus it means in a test tube in a test tube, it it means proteins can arrange if proteins and nucleic acid is present and then according to information of rna proteins can uh, bind around the rna or dna or nucleic acid okay so there is no special uh, there is no need uh, of special enzyme for packaging or assembly there is no need of special energy for assembly uh, structural protein uh, arranged around the dna but according to information of the uh, dna or rna of the virus so uh, this is actually a uh, this is actually assembly or packaging of the virus in this slide you can uh, observe some uh, important phenomena assembly after assembly a virus uh, wants to release into the uh, virus wants to release into the external environment to infect other host cells uh, because hundred of copies are uh, are formed in a, in a single host cell then uh, release of these hundred of copies uh, can be dangerous for other host cell or can be infected for other host cells so how release of these viruses occurs uh, because you have already studied that due to cytopathic effects of the uh, viruses cell has already cell has already uh, diminished his work or uh, cell has already uh, forward forward to perform his functions normally so how release of non enveloped viruses occurs uh, in non in, in case of non enveloped viruses complete shape formation or complete mature virus formation or complete assembly of uh, uh structural protein or in or complete nucleocapsid formation occurs within the cell so 100 of viruses uh, prepare uh, uh, 100 of uh, viruses uh, prepared within the cells and then after a suitable time after a release of after a, a suitable time or after formation of enough number of viruses within the cell uh, suddenly virus host cell gets ruptured 
होल्स व्हेन होल सेल गेट्स रब्चर सडनली नंबर सडनली हंड्रेड ऑफ सेल्स हंड्रेड ऑफ वायरल हंड्रेड ऑफ न्यूली फॉर्म्ड वायरल सेल्स वायरस रिलीज इनटू द एक्स्ट्रा सेलुलर स्पेसेस सो व्हेन हंड्रेड ऑफ वायरस न्यू वायरस रिलीज इनटू द एक्स्ट्रा सेलुलर स्पेसेस इट कैन इन्फेक्ट हंड्रेड ऑफ न्यू host cells so uh, this is actually uh, known in uh, this is actually release of non enveloped viruses there is a slight difference between the release of non enveloped viruses and the uh, enveloped viruses you have already studied that the around enveloped viruses there is an enveloped uh, uh, is uh, there is an enveloped which is present uh, uh, which actually envelop uh, how enveloped form envelop is actually a part of cell membrane of uh, uh, uh host cell so let's discuss about the release of uh, enveloped viruses so release and the uh, how release of enveloped viruses occur uh, we have already studied that there is a cell membrane part of host cell present around the uh, virus cell which uh, which forms uh, which forms enveloped around viruses and this envelope is involved in the virulence of the uh, virus as well so uh, how enveloped viruses uh, uh, release uh, a very important phenomena uh, occurs which is known as budding this is not all the budding like uh, bacteria uh, bacter in bacteria budding is actually a uh, formation of one single uh, formation of new cell from one single cell in case uh, both uh, they are not actually infectious they are actually they are uh, they are involved in reproduction they are involved they are involved in non sexual reproduction but in this case uh, enveloped viruses after replication release into the environment through budding when uh, a complete virus forms then when a complete when a complete uh, nucleocapsid of virus when a complete nucleocapsid of virus forms then it attached in the uh, it attached with the cell membrane from internal side uh, at a suitable uh, site ठीक है इट मीन्स जब न्यूक्लियो कैप्सिड बन जाता है न्यूक्लियो कैप्सिड बन जाता है तो वो सेल के अंदर कहीं जगहों पर किसी ऐसी सूटेबल जगह पर सेल में ब्रेन के ऊपर अटैक करता है उसके साथ बाइंड कर सकता है सो यू कैन यू कैन ऑल्सो लुक इन सेकंड सेकंड डायग्राम इन विच न्यूक्लिक एसिड न्यूक्लिक एसिड स्ट्रक्चरल प्रोटीन्स फ्रॉम दी फ्रॉम दी आउटर फ्रॉम दी आउटर पोर्शन ऑफ द सेल स्टार्ट अरेंजिंग स्टार्ट अरेंजिंग अराउंड दी न्यूक्लियो कैप्सिड वैन स्ट्रक्चरल प्रोटीन अरेंज अराउंड द न्यूक्लियो वायर न्यूक्लियो कैप्सिड थैन इन थर्ड डायग्राम यू कैन ऑब्जर्व डैट द स्ट्रक्चर ऑब्जर्व डैट सेल में ब्रेन इनवेजिनेट सेल में ब्रेन इनवेजिनेट एंड स्ट्रक्चरल प्रोटीन्स कम्प्लीटली अरेंज अराउंड द वायरस एंड यू कैन ऑल्सो ऑब्जर्व डेट जस्ट नॉट वायरस इज रिलीजिंग सेल अ पार्ट ऑफ सेल में ब्रेन इज ऑल्सो प्रेजेंट ऑन द सेल्स विच इज एक्चुअली अ ब्लू पार्ट यू कैन ऑब्जर्व अ पार्ट ऑफ सेल में ब्रेन इज ऑल्सो प्रेजेंट ऑन दिस ऑन द वायरस सो दिस ब्लू पार्ट और पार्ट ऑफ सेल में ब्रेन is actually envelop so after formation of uh, complete structure of virus virus released into the uh, in released into the external environment along with a small portion of cell membrane which is actually in envelop of uh, virus so uh, this uh, this was all about enveloped viruses uh i think there is uh, no another thing to discuss around about enveloped viruses so uh